approachable. No maraka. Gumas. Huh? He looks cheeky. I'm k i d i n g no, he's like the same as Apple. Huh? Can't say. I'm k i d i n g I'm k i d i n g he's a boy. Here we go. So, tell me more about this rebranding project for Happy Fresh. So we are a four-year-old company, and it's about time we look at this whole rebranding process. This is David, VP of Marketing. He really wanted the rebranding to happen. We look at how it's going to represent us and how else we can improve it. So the first thing we really look at is Apple Boy, which is our mascot. That's where we start off from, and also of course our logo, Happy Fresh, or as you may know it from this guy. Is an online grocery startup that was founded in 2015. I think what's frustrating for me really is also to see and know that there are a lot of people out there that are still not aware after four years of doing what we do, why we do it, and basically who we are. I like a logo, but I know that it doesn't represent exactly who we are and what we're trying to do with our business. This is Johan, Chief Growth Officer. He's actually the one who first suggested that Happy Fresh needed a rebranding. Weird, huh? Coming from a numbers-oriented guy. Okay, keep going. The data told us that there's a mismatch of how customers perceive us and how we want to be perceived as in the market. Uh, we needed a brand that can unify us across the region. Hold up, guys. This is easier said than done, and it actually took a long 11 months of collaboration with our branding partner for it to be finalized. It's not just about the logo; it's the whole package. We want to make sure that the logo and the package represents not only what Happy Fresh is today. But also what we want to achieve in the future. And here's Guillem, CEO, with you might have guessed it, the vision and the mission. It's also about our customers, clients, partners. Uh, we want to empower people to make smart choices when it comes to food, when it comes to health, lifestyle, environment. So the brand should really empower that message across. Um, we are actually having an impact into millions of people's lives and livelihood. So the feel and touch of the brand should really carry that on. Okay, the branding team is taking notes. It needs to stand out, but not be too crazy. So we asked ourselves a lot of questions during the rebranding process, and I think one of the questions that came out was, "How is our personality going to shine after this? Is color, is color going to do the trick? Should we change our main colors from orange and green to something else?" Um, you see, with, with the problem that we have is we don't want to change so much, such that people don't even recognize us anymore. No, that's too realistic. Is it welcoming enough? Is it like smart enough, empowering enough, bold, but yet still friendly? It should resonate with our customers. We need to strip it down and keep it simple. Modernizing the brand by adding that component of trust that our customers already have uh, with our brand, and bringing all together with a sense of maturity to it. We need to go back to the basics. Okay, now they're getting somewhere, and guess what? It all started with Apple Boy, stripping it down from where it looks like shapes, colors, and finally representing it with typography. Ta-da! What do you think, guys? I like it. Yes, I love it. It's good. We've stripped down the logo and removed Apple Boy. We've updated the font to be a little bit more mature. The look and feel is quite similar to how it was before. This also shows that we're still true to our original mission. While uh, being more relevant and more mature as a company, it's a breath of fresh air for all of us here. At Happy Fresh, and of course for our customers and our partners, um, right from the new logo to to the whole thing that is going to come with it, like the visual, the photography style, the font type, the colors, the, the basically the new look and feel, and the way we sound. Um, overall, I think I'm happy about the fresh new look of Happy Fresh. Uh... If you know him, the pun is intended. <laughs>